Okay, okay. so who, which one of you is going to okay. tell me what we're Hold doing? On. I am going to go me. with something. Matt, what are we doing? Science. Science? Like any specific science or just, just general science? You getting a cutting board? Okay. Matt, don't touch anything. Oh, uh, that doesn't seem... Okay. <laughs> okay. So, what we are going to learn about today is a process called sublim sublim oh my goodness sublimation okay and sublimation is when something that is a solid goes from a solid to a gas without becoming a liquid so think about like when you have your cup with ice in it what happens when that cup sits out what? the ice what the ice melts and it turns yeah. into what water. water and then if that cup sits long enough what happens to the water in the cup? Think kind of the your, same thing that happens outside. Song. It evaporates. It evaporates. Very okay? good. And so the solid, the ice cube, turns into a liquid, and then that liquid turns into a gas. It goes up into the sky, and it becomes clouds, and then the liquid falls to the ground again. Or sometimes... The, the gas liquid, turns into a liquid. The, li the gas turns into a liquid, and the liquid falls to the ground. Sometimes the liquid turns into ice or snow as it falls to the ground, which is a solid. And then it goes back, okay? <laughs> uh, so what yes. we're going to see happen right now... Remember I told you this is really cold? Okay? Mm -hmm. This... You can't touch it. It will burn me? It, it will, will burn, burn you. had to go... I couldn't find my small channel lock, so I had to get the big ones. Okay? Which is kind of overkill, but whatever. This is... Minus 110 degrees Fahrenheit. Hmm. That means it's like, let's see, 32 degrees Fahrenheit is, is uh, the temperature that water becomes ice. So this is... It's a lot colder than that. ish times colder than ice. Yeah. Okay? All right. And so what's going to happen is when I drop this in, it's going to boil. Like, you know when we put on a pot on the stove for macaroni cheese? Is it going to boil cheese? over? Hold up. Okay. Hold up. What? What are we doing? What are we doing? They want to see. Oh, oh they, they want to see? see? Okay. okay. All right. So. Well, get your audience set up. All right. Face Goofy, them. Goofy and Woody. Anybody okay, else want to here, watch? Here's, uh, I don't even know who these people are. Milan oh. and, and Is it Milan? Girl. Oh, yeah, it is Milan. And Elastigirl. And Elastigirl. Okay. okay. So, I'm going to drop this in here, and what's going to happen is this is going to boil. The water isn't going to boil, but the solid carbon dioxide is going to start to boil. And you, you ready? are going to really like Don't what watch. happens. Okay. Watch. Pay attention. Three, two, one. Maybe. Oh, it's... Oh, yeah. That's cold. Is so just... what's happening oh, no, right it's now... Steam. It's steam coming out. What's happening right now is that Gosh. that solid okay. carbon dioxide. Matt, it's fine, buddy. It's fine, buddy. It's not fine. It's, it's going to burn me. No, no it's, it's not, not. going to burn you. It's just like. Touch it. Touch some the people gas. Use, some people use this at. Some people <laughs> use this at Halloween, like a fog machine. Lots of people, yeah. Honestly, the fact that Karen hasn't done this is shocking. It's because it's hard to find dry ice. Oh well. So okay, so look at look at the dry ice that's in there. Does it look like it looked it before looks it went like in? It's because what's happening... Because look at the side. It kind of looks like it has lines. What's happening yeah. is the water that's in there is creating an ice cube around the sides of the dry ice because the gas, the, the carbon dioxide that is that is is boiling and it's becoming a gas again. So this is what sublimation is. It's There's no liquid. The carbon dioxide isn't turning into a liquid first. It's going from a solid immediately to a gas. And when it does that, it creates this spooky fog. Um, can I touch it? You can touch the fog. Just yeah, don't just... stick. Don't stick your hand all the way into the water. Oh, like it's not even in the water. You can't even feel it. <laughs> yeah. Look at that. Now, do you want to see something? I want to catch some. You want to catch some here? Let me help you. Okay. So you're gonna take your hand. And you're just gonna scoop it like that. Hi. And see, it disappears. How does it disappear? Well, it's the gas starts and to thin out. Whenever I get closer, so, whenever I get closer to the ice cube. See, you can still see it kind of in my hand. Yeah. And then I let it go, and I can scoop up some more. Let's see. Okay. Now, watch this. I want to try. Yeah. Watch this. 
Oh, I'm gonna try it. Out. <laughs> hold on, let more of it. Oh, hold on, let, let it, it, let it let collect it. a little bit. So you now, blew it away. I did. Now here's the other thing. So that's pretty cool, huh? Now don't breathe it in, okay? Because what do our lungs need when we breathe in? What are our lungs? In, do you remember what in our what in the air the lungs are trying to? Look how cold it made that. Yeah. Do you remember what what in what in the air our lungs specifically is trying to take in? Breath. Uh, oxygen. Oxygen. Okay. Very good. So this is carbon dioxide. This is what our lungs. Every time we breathe out, we're breathing out carbon dioxide. Now I'm going to show you something really cool. Can you sit there for just a second? He can do. What do you think so far? Oh, Goofy wants to try. Don't drop him in there. I don't know what'll happen. Probably nothing. But good job, Goofy. I blew it into him, and it's still came out. What do you think about this science experiment so far? Really cool. But how is it still bubbling? Well, because of the brick. I'm gonna buddy, let this. I don't know for sure. That's a question for your dad, but I'm pretty sure it'll keep bubbling until that brick is that. So that block until is gone. that block is completely gone, it's going to continue to boil. Now. So, when we have a fire... Oh, God. What are you about to do? When we have a fire, the fire is going to use the same thing our lungs use. The fire needs oxygen. Matt, okay? stop. Pay attention so to your dad. So, when we blow out a candle, what we're doing is we're blowing the oxygen away from the candle or the, the flame of the match, and that causes the match to go out. Okay? I'm but try to blow watch, it. But watch this. You don't even need to. It needs, it needs did you hear oxygen. What your, did Listen, you hear what your dad said? The flame has to have oxygen to survive. If there's no and oxygen, what, the flame goes out. And what did your dad tell you that was? What is this? Is that oxygen? Oxygen. No. No, it's the opposite. Carbon dioxide. Well, it's not the opposite. And it's nothing but carbon dioxide. Because of our air pressure, all of the good air is above the rim of this. This is all carbon dioxide gas. I'm making it blow on your okay. finger. Okay, now don't let it blow. I want you to just watch it. Watch this. Okay. Can I please just Ma put it out? No. No. Aww. Maybe the next maybe one. Gonna, maybe I can do watch. another one. Even this one's gonna watch. Yeah, watch what I happens. What okay. Watch what happens. So I'm gonna strike it. I'm gonna let this start to. Okay. We're gonna get a nice flame and watch. I'm not gonna do anything. Watch what happens when it hits the gas. How? Because there's no oxygen. The fire, the has, fire to have oxygen. has to have oxygen. And as soon as it touches this, this is nothing but carbon dioxide gas. There's no oxygen at all in there. So as soon as this hits that, it immediately goes out. It doesn't matter how many times or how big I let this flame get. This goes out. It goes out as soon as it touches that because there's no oxygen to keep that flame alive. Uh, can I just blow one out? Can you blow one out? Yes. Yeah. I'm going to let it get big and then blow well, it out. You're going to blow it out before it burns my finger. How about that? Okay. So we'll hold on. Hold on, I'll tell you when. No All right, way. three, two, one. Did you make a wish? Oh, yeah. But here's the cool thing. Did you notice how the end of that was still red when you blew it out? Watch. Watch when I do it. How many matches we use in here? Oh, we have so many matches. It's okay. fine. Okay, watch the end of this when I blow it out. Watch the tip. You see how the tip's getting redder and redder? Yeah. Watch when I blow it out. See how you see it still glow for a minute? Yeah. Okay, now, watch what happens to the tip of it when I put it inside that gas. Stop. We gotta let it, we gotta let it. Yeah. It just blew a smoke ring. It a perfect little smoke ring just popped out of there. Okay, don't, I'm stop, another stop, one. no, stop, hold on. Watch, the tip is not gonna be red at all when this happens. Okay, so I'm gonna let it start to grow. We see the tips glowing red. You see that? Mm -hmm. See how it's glowing? Now watch. No, when, I dip, the fire. when I dip it oh, in Oh no, here, it's coming toward. The tip immediately goes black because the, the oxygen isn't even there to keep the embers burning. I like blowing this. Okay, hold on. We got another experiment to do with it. Woohoo! Okay, we're back. Right. Greg, what are we doing now? Right, so now... So we, you know how you were trying to scoop, you know how you were trying to scoop this carbon dioxide gas in your hand and it wasn't really working too, too well. Okay. I'm going to make it easier for you. Are you ready? Yeah. Do you know what this is? Uh, soap. Soap. Guess what's going to happen? Oh, I need, um, do we have an extra chopstick here? 
Uh, no, but there's some in the drawer. Is this a chopstick? No, that's a rubber leave it there. There's some in the drawer. The third drawer down. The junk-ish drawer. Okay, stop. Let it go. Chopsticks? Wait, look. Oh, I can see the wait, what? Why are you stirring that? I don't know what we're doing. So, that soap, notice there's not a whole lot of gas coming up anymore. Oh, no. Because look what's happening. Oh, jeez. It. It's bubbling. It's bubbling. But, but I just don't want to touch it because it's probably hot. It's no, not hot. It's not Nothing hot. about that so, is hot. So, in order to get carbon... Oh, hold on. In order to get carbon dioxide gas into a solid state like that block of dry ice, you have to increase the pressure so much and, and or maybe it's... Yeah, you have to increase the pressure oh and make gosh, it Oh my gosh, it's going to leak. Okay? The water is causing it to boil because... Whoa! All of these bubbles are just filled with carbon dioxide. That's so why it's this. so cold. Wait, how is it getting oh. little? What are you trying to do? I'm trying to cut it so they float up. Yeah, I don't think that's As it continues happen. to grow, it should just slide right off the top. Here, oh. just scoop it with your hand. And it's not cold at all, is it? It's kind of cold. I'm washing my hands. Okay, well, that's not so for your hands, but that's okay. Yeah. It sort of works. Mm -hmm. Here, let me give it another stir. Where's mine? Yeah. But it's getting bigger. It kind of looks like a witch's cauldron. It's pretty cool, huh? Can no. I blow up? Can I do it? Hold on, I'm trying this? to get this back to the center so it fills the bubbles from the center up. It hasn't been in the center for quite some time. Mm, I want to try. I don't think the bottom of that's like, I think the bottom's Look. curved. You cutting it. the bubbles? Hiya! Hey, watch this. Ooh, ooh, I want to try that. I want to try that. How is it going? Don't. <laughs> Ooh. You're being a good boy, Clarence. Thank you. Gus, you're always being a good boy. No. No. <laughs> Can I tell you what? It wouldn't hurt you, but it's going to taste like soap. I wasn't going to eat it. Okay. Well, what if it accidentally fell into your mouth? I'm a so what do you? So what do you think about this? I'm a, I'm a warlock. You're a warlock? Whoa! Oh, giant bubble that popped. See, okay. I'm magic. What do you think about this experiment? There's a big bubble right here. Wait, stop, 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 stop. Can mommy see these two big bubbles? Yep, I, I want to I pop one. No, no, let it go. Let it go. They're going to keep getting bigger. Or get and forced then to pop the, it. Yeah, and, and then, then let, them get, let them get higher up. Nope, don't stir it. Don't It'll stir pop it. the bubbles. But we want to get that dry ice. Matt, I'll pop it with No, no, no. Pop stop. it with your finger. No, you're going to use your finger to pop. Oh no, it's getting smaller. It is getting smaller because the bubbles are running on it. Up. Yeah, that was a fail. Mm, we tried. Whoa. So what do you think about this? <laughs> it's fun, right? Yeah, so I'm washing hey, my hands. you're washing your hands? We're going to actually go, gonna wash, actually hands go wash your hands. Because mine are... Wait! They're, they're slimy. I just wanna... They're kitchen soap slimy. I just wanna... Well, here, let me take this out of there so you can do it. But you gotta wait till they. You gotta wait till up. they're up to the to the surface. Here, feel how cold this is. <laughs> That's like the cold I like. That's the cold you like. Yeah, I love this cold. So right now we can touch this, but if the dry ice was outside of this, we couldn't touch the dry ice itself. But here, can you see how? Can you look around yeah, the side? Oh my gosh! I don't know whether your mommy can see it so or not. Small. You see how it looks really shiny? Wait, yeah. Right here. Look. See how it looks really shiny? Yeah. And you notice how there's not any bubbles coming from this end or from this end. They're coming from that little peak on the top. Yeah. That's because the water has formed an ice cube all around everywhere but the top where the gas is escaping from. Where's all the smoke? Huh? Nobody it's all trapped inside the bubbles. 
Look, there's I ice got left it. behind. It froze the water on the bottom. I just broke it up though. I'm gonna leave it right in the center. Break. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I got it, I got it in the perfect spot. Stop, stop, stop. See how it's getting taller quicker? I got it right in the center, so all the bubbles are coming right up the middle and not off the sides anymore. This is pretty fun. Ding, 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 ding. One shot. You like I the science lunch. experiment? I want lunch time. So this is, this is a science experiment that we can do once a year. Why? Well, because you know how Daddy got dry ice? No. They used dry ice to keep all of the fundraiser stuff that my kids sold that came to school on Wednesday was packed with two boxes full of containers of dry ice. And who got it? Well, I, I gave, assume that he gave them to the science teachers. I gave teachers. them to the science teachers first. So, so Mr. Walters, Kurt, that we saw before we left, he did nothing but dry ice day to day with all of his science classes. They got to play with dry ice and learn about chemical reactions. <gasps> Buddy, look at that giant bubble. Yeah. Oh, you just popped it. What? I was trying to make it bigger. You are? Wait, oh, you are onto something, man. Let's see if I can make you a big one. Pop it. There's another one. Pop it. Good job. Okay.